And now we have developing news on the eastern shore. Investigators say they found a child near the scene of what appears to be a mother and father's murder-suicide. Deputies discovered the couple Saturday at the end of Pierce Taylor Road in Mapsville. Then at your size, Liz Kilmer has been working to learn more tonight and joins us from the sheriff's office with the latest. And that suspect was one of their own. Jonan Gonzalez Funes was a correctional officer. Investigators believe he shot and killed the mother of his child, Elizabeth Jensen, before turning the gun on himself. We're told that the couple's young daughter was found with their bodies. This gorgeous, perfect boyfriend of mine is how 20 year old Elizabeth Madison Jensen described 27 year old Jonan Gonzalez Funes in this Facebook post from 2014. A man who investigators believe killed her and then himself. Couldn't believe it, honestly. It was a neighbor's sad discovery Saturday morning within this park. Investigators say the couple was found shot to death inside a vehicle. Their infant daughter, there too, alive. I can just imagine, you know what her family's going through, you know, they didn't just lose her, you know, they have to explain to that baby when when she grows up, you know, what happened to her mom and her dad. According to the Accomack County Sheriff's Office, Gonzalez Funes worked for them. He was a correctional officer since September of last year. JC Sneed and Chrissy Paget remember him while serving time. He was a guard. Never thought he would do something like that. I didn't think he was even ever capable of something like that. He seemed like an R.A.D. Sneed says he also knew Jensen's father. I'm sure he's probably really hurt. Uh, I can't imagine how he's going to feel right now. Friends say she was always smiling and she loved to ride horses. Over the phone, 10 on your side spoke with a cousin of Gonzalez Funes. He tells us the family is confused by how this could happen. The man they remember was never violent. They say he deployed twice as a Marine and was a good man. And the couple's child was not heard and is right now in the care of other family members. Investigators say their findings are preliminary and autopsy results are pending. Reporting in Accomack County, I'm Liz Kilmer, 10 on your side.